you doing? You looking like here? Being a very good boy. You've been a very good boy for the last three days. Yeah, that's why you get to meet the family and hang out. You just gotta sleep here at night. Yeah. What are you doing? You just gotta sleep here at night, because otherwise I don't know what'll happen. What do you know? Good boy. Good boy. Good kisses. Yeah, come down here, so you can be in the light. Good boy. What do you know? It's okay. Don't try to bite me. That's why you gotta sleep in a cage at night. It's okay. Banjo. Good boy. Here you sleep. Banjo. Me. I know. I get it. That's your that's your upset head. Yeah. What are you doing? That's your proper cranky head. Yeah, you're staring away, looking away, trying to find something else to do. Jess, not now. Move please. Oh Jess, come here. Let's see if you can help. Watch out, you might get bitten on nose. Yeah, here's the cranky one. It's not your fault. Good boy. Jess, move. Cranky mode. God boy. You got dinner everywhere. Come here. Brownie, we've been such good friends. As I said, last three days. And that was only a half try to bite. It wasn't even a real try to bite. And it's okay. We've got ages. And you've been so good today. We have Lots of times in the day where we hang out and kick around. You're not allowed to play with the other puppies. They're allowed to come and sniff you and do stuff. But you're on lead still continuously whenever we're out. For the number one reason is you're a little escape Alcatraz puppy dog. So you find all these bars and you go around and make sure you check all of them. Good boy! How you doing? No, oh, see that freezing bit? Hey, dude. We've known each other now. Oi, what's your name? Brownie. Hey, Brownie. Come here. Come here. Cranky head. I'll make a noise. That'll get all the other puppies' attention. So I'm going to close this. Now you want to bite me? We've got to deal with it. Don't. I'll make sure that that light can see in the video. At least if I'm going to get bitten doing this with you. At least might as well make it worthwhile, yeah? How's this? Is that better? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to reach in. Don't bite me. I'm going to grab your lead from this end. Just leave it there, just in case. Now, dude, what's going on? Mm -hmm. What's going on? Just sniff that. 
We made good friends. So, I'm not going to be stupid enough to stick my hands in between the bars. Mr. Fox, nothing to do with you. Thank you, though. What I'm going to do is I'm going to utilise trying to find the video. Yes. Oh, good boy. Very good. Not hard to stay there. Oh, very good. Good boy. He's not impressed. As we can see. It's okay. It's okay. Come here. Come here. Miss, what's your name? Brownie. Come here. Come on. Please don't make growling noises over there and rescue with each other. It doesn't help my situation at all. Oi, those growling noises need to stop. Alright, little dude. What I'm gonna do, just to show people. Oh, yep. Same thing, no, just trying to touch. It's okay. Good boy. It's not his fault. He's not doing anything bad. Just being a puppy dog. Showing you all of the freeze movements. Good boy. It's okay. Yeah. That's his proper cranky head there. He's ready to go. Right there. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. And remembering, he can stick his head out to touch me here. There we are too, by the way. It's okay. Hey, dude. Brownie. It's okay. Oh boy. Yeah. Gonna pick up a random object. God boy. Just to give him the sniff, to change his brain off what he was thinking. I got a good puppy helper here. Perfect timing, Jess. Jess, come and help. You're scared. Thanks. We can do it. Oh, good, Mr. Fox. You and you and Brownie are friends. I know. Good boy. Go play. Go play. So I'm asking the other dogs to come in now. Give him some hand, yeah, a bit of a hand. How you doing? Dude, Brownie, call me on. Mr. Fox, eating his, the food on the outside of the cage isn't going to help the situation, is it? Mr. Fox, if you're only here to eat food, it's, it's not going to help the situation. So you don't need to be a do body language dog expert to understand that he looks cautious. But what I'm looking at is the continuous blinking. Right, the blinking is telling me he doesn't have an intention to, to harm or to hurt me. He doesn't want to escalate the situation. He'd really like me to move. Now, I'm more than happy to, and he's uncomfortable. He's got many other places and options to go to here. Not a lot, not not massive amounts, but. We're looking at the situation of where he was going to be killed for fighting with the other animals and the dogs and the things in his in his previous household. So he's coming here to learn how to interact with dogs and, and other humans. So he's going to be uh, probably a six month or so uh, project. Hey, Don, good boy. It's okay. Come here, Brownie. Come on. Pop, pop. Rest of you stay. I know. That's a funny noise, isn't it? That messes with your head. Rest of you stay. Sasha, stay. I forgot about you. Sorry, you don't really know how to stop that noise yet. Rest of you stay. Alright, what we're going to do, we're going to do you a favour. I'm going to leave you alone right now. I'll come back later and we'll hang out again. Come here. It's okay. Yeah. Oh, good cool boy. That licking then is showing me the tongue. It's an appeasement gesture, a calming signal. He's showing an intention or a desire to interact um, by showing their tongue 
they're, they're indicating that they, they, they can interact and they want to at that time. When they have dog fights, there's no blood on their tongue. It, it's because they retract it from a Jacob's organ at the back of their throat. Therefore, when they're doing really, really quick licks, they're concerned and wanting to interact. When they do ones up the side of their mouth, there's, there's many, 50 plus, whatever. Doesn't matter. That's not the point. Um, when they lick on the side of their mouth, they're, they're doing it right there. Good boy. He's trying to interact. Good boy. There's that really quick lick out the front of his mouth. So he's just showing he wants to interact. He doesn't want to cause harm or, in, or do anything negative. But he wants the situation to be reduced. And then goes to yawning because by them having their mouth open, they're vulnerable at that time. There's a whole lot of stuff. Anywho, let's do this. I'm going to try to hang on to here. Oh, my knees and, and body. Good boy. Very good. Every day, yeah. Anyway, I'll turn your light off. I'll give you some peace, food, and your own. Mr. Fox, you're not helping that situation at all. I love your work. I thank you for your effort. Good boys and girls. Good brownie. Very good. Very good. I know. Life happens. Sorry about that. Yeah, good boy. Very good. All right, we're nearly in there. Watch out, puppy dogs. Hello, bouncy dog. Sasha, can you hop back up? I know you're off lead tonight. Because, eh, well, not just tonight, many times. Hop back up. Stop. Now. Sasha, very good. I love you too. Move. You'll find a very good home soon. Sasha. Ah, Milo, leave it. Thank you. Milo, move away. If you don't like her, don't come and sit down next to her. Like, it's not rocket science, hey. Sasha, stop and drop. No, that's not an option. Oi, come here. Sasha, quick, good girl. Come here, please. Hogwarts or lay down? Sasha, Hogwarts, leave the fire alone. That'll burn your nose. Hogwarts or lay down? It's your choice. Just there. Good decision. Very good. Right on. So, this is how we live in our funny little world. Lots of puppies and ponies and things. The other dog attempting to bite and freezing and things. It's not a negative. It's his first time for quite a few days of trying to do that. Not his fault. He's probably sleepy. It's silly o'clock when we're making this video. I just wanted to make it for uh, both their parents. <laughs> He's been hanging out and being good, but I haven't made videos. And when I didn't, he wasn't. Happy days. Take care.